By subscribing and liking the content, give us a like to continue delivering the most important information. Stay safe by being vigilant. With that out of the way, let's delve into today's news. Tragic death of Boeing whistleblower sheds light on corporate culture and quality control concerns. The recent death of John Barnett, a former Boeing quality manager and whistleblower, has reignited scrutiny over the aerospace giant's internal practices and treatment of employees who raise concerns about quality control issues. Barnett, who was found dead earlier this month from what appeared to be a self-inflicted gunshot wound, had been embroiled in a legal battle against Boeing, alleging harassment and constructive discharge. According to documents released by Barnett's attorneys, he had raised numerous ethics complaints about a culture of concealment at Boeing South Carolina BSC, where he and other quality personnel were allegedly pressured by upper management to overlook defects and violate Federal Aviation Administration standards and regulations. Barnett's refusal to comply with these directives reportedly led to retaliation, including low performance scores, isolation from his team, and being blocked from transferring to other Boeing divisions. The lawsuit, filed with the U.S. Department of Labor, outlines instances where Barnett objected to unauthorized programs and improper procedures, such as the multifunction process performer, which allowed mechanics to inspect and approve their own work without FAA approval. Additionally, Barnett highlighted concerns about stolen parts being installed on airplanes without proper documentation or engineering review. Furthermore, the lawsuit details a hostile work environment where Barnett was allegedly harassed, denigrated, and humiliated by upper management in an effort to discourage him from raising issues and complying with the law. These tactics ultimately led to Barnett's constructive discharge in March 2017. Boeing, in response to the lawsuit, expressed condolences for Barnett's passing and stated that they had addressed the quality issues he raised before his retirement in 2017. However, the circumstances surrounding Barnett's death and the allegations outlined in the lawsuit have raised questions about Boeing's corporate culture and its handling of whistleblowers. As investigations continue into Barnett's death and the allegations against Boeing, the aerospace industry faces renewed scrutiny over the importance of fostering a culture of transparency, accountability, and ethical conduct to ensure the safety and integrity of its products. For further updates and in-eth coverage of this developing story, stay tuned to reputable news sources and investigative reports. And now, as we reach the end of our news segment, please remember, for a detailed list of our sources, you can find them in the description of our YouTube video. Thank you to everyone who watched today's program. Remember, by following us, you become part of a reliable source for information and advice. Whether you like the program or not, please press subscribe to join our community. This helps us improve and ensures you are among the first to receive our latest news and programs. Don't forget to hit the like button and share our channel with your friends. Farewell, until we meet again.